Hello guys, my name is Diana Muñoz, I'm a Canva Certified Creative and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create animated videos for your social media. So let's jump into my Canva homepage and as you see here uh, where it says create a design, there is one category called animated social media. If you don't see this option here on this carousel, you can just type here animated social media and it appears here so let's click here and uh, we'll see that Canva uh, they take us to a new page and it has a bunch of different uh, templates with animated stickers and movements and like really cool options so I'm going to scroll here and select one of these templates uh, actually, there are a couple that I really like, like this uh, grandma here and some other, like this one, but this one is too girly. So I think I'm gonna go for this one because actually I'm gonna use one of our videos and uh, include it into our uh, animated social media post. So I'm gonna click on this one and I'm not a fan of the color selection and fonts, but actually I'm going to use my uh, branded colors and branded fonts, so um, it doesn't matter, I will change these colors. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to uh, click on the background and click here on the color menu and I'm going to select one of my colors. So I have Canva Pro, a Canva Pro account, and that's why I was able to create these color palettes. And I'm going to select one of them, this dark pink or flamingo color. <laughs> and then I'm going to change the color of these blobs. So I'm going to click here again, the menu option, and I'm going to use the green color. And instead of doing these uh, steps for the other blobs, I'm just going to click here where it says change all this color to this color. So click here and automatically we'll see that these two blobs change color. Next, I'm going to change the text and I really like to uh, ungroup these text boxes when I'm using a template because they always come grouped and uh, I, ha I, I don't know, I would like to have more flexibility when I'm working with these templates, so I ungroup them. And now I have my text here in a little notepad, and I know I want to include, uh, include in this design new cars, uh, create animated stories for Facebook and Instagram, and more information. And here we have our uh, link. So, uh, I want to create an animated post to promote our new course. Uh, we see here that we created, we are creating actually, a list of different courses, 10 courses, 10 Canva courses. So we have a really new course here, uh, animated stories for Instagram and Facebook and Instagram with Canva. So I want to promote this course in a specific. And if you would like to have access to our Rondi Bootcamp, which is hosted in Skillshare, we left the link in the description box so you can access. And let's go back to Canva. I'm going to uh, copy and paste this uh, text to my design. So let's uh, put the new course here and let's copy this here which I think is the most important is the title of the course because it already has all the important keywords. I'm going to change the font for my branded font and make this text smaller, kind of like this. Let's try. <laughs> and then let's uh, copy the last bit of information and paste it on the last text box. So uh, I think I'm going to change also this uh, font for my branded font and reduce this 
the letter spacing and actually make it bigger because we cannot see it very well and finally let's change this text uh, box for our branded font too so like that is more on brand and lastly uh, here on the uploads section we have images and videos so we can upload images or videos with this button here and I already uploaded my video so I uploaded here a short video, 1 minute and 43 uh, seconds, which is the introduction to our course. This is actually kind of a long video or heavy video for Canva, I think. I'm mostly working with 9 seconds video, 8, 15, uh, because it makes everything faster. But in this case, I think I want to have this uh, introduction video and uh, I'm going to put or drag this video into this frame. So as you see, it works. And we can have a more creative uh, design here. So I'm just going to move uh, this blob a little bit here. Maybe I'm going to change the, the size of this text so we can move this blob uh, down here and make this video bigger I think like this let me move these stars kind of to this area um, yes I forgot to change the name of this um, design so let's uh, put social media post and what I'm going to do is that I'm going to download this video I'm going to click here on this button and file type going to select video and download so I'm going to teach you two different ways on how to download this video the first one the one that I'm doing now it's uh, already an animated video because we have animated stickers and uh, we cut uh, our video in a really cool uh, shape but the second option we are going to include an extra animation so at the beginning of the video we'll see that all the elements are going to be flying around and uh, I think I like that option best uh, but I want to show you the two options because maybe for some brands uh, they cannot or they wouldn't like to have something so um, let's say maybe creative like some brands they need to show a more serious uh, face or you know like not so crazy I would say <laughs> so I think this option will be best uh, but yeah let's wait and I will show you the two different options and you will decide which one is best for you or your brand let's wait okay this one wasn't so uh, slow and let's uh, put this one here okay so we have our first option here let's open it so i think it's already looking really cool i really really like it uh, let's close this one and i will show you the second option so for this we are going to click on the background and uh, we will see that this button animate button appears so before it wasn't there and now it appears that is the way to activate our button and uh yes so you need to be careful because if you have something in the background and for example i like click on this blob uh, you won't have anything like animate uh, icon here so you need to click on the background then let's click here and we have all these different options from block to simple like all these are free so canva for free uh, users can use all these different options and then we have all these different um, options with the crown which are premium effects so yeah the one that i really uh, or that i like the most is this one scrapbook <laughs> and I will show you one of these examples I have in my uh, Spanish Facebook group Trucos para Instagram and Canva en Español uh, Let's see the beginning 
You see, it's really, really cool. I love this one. This kind of animation is uh, everything. <laughs> but uh, for this example, I want to stick to free options. So everyone can have access to this or can follow this tutorial. So uh, the other one, the free one that I like is this one, Tumble. So let's click here and you already see a little preview. So when you click on this uh, different icons or different buttons, you can see a preview of how it will look on your final video. So let's click on Tumble. I think this one is already working really fine with all these blobs flying around. And yeah, you can also see a preview here with this button. Let's close and let's download. So let's wait until it is finished. And uh, yes, maybe uh, I think this will this design will take a little longer to download because it has so many different elements and also the video that I included in this uh, specific video, it's kind of heavy and long, like almost two minutes. So Canva will take some time because it needs to render the stickers, the animated stickers, it needs to render a cropped video and uh, what else, the animation that I already put, uh, I just put. So yeah, it will take some little uh, time, but when it's finished, I will come back to you and show you the two different options. Okay, so it took a long time until this design uh, downloaded, exported and uh here we have it so let's click here and let's open it <laughs> i really love it so let me open the other video and let's see which one do we prefer so this one is the number one so the first one just oh wait this one is the first one this, the first one, it starts like already in place, everything. And the second one, we have this extra movement at the beginning. <laughs> so which one do you prefer? In my personal opinion, I prefer the second option. But yeah, I understand that some other brands, they will need something less crazy and yeah something that just delivers the content but like if i think about my brand i prefer something more fun and moving so i will go for option two which one do you think uh, and also i would like to know if you will uh, change something in this design the colors or the fonts something that you didn't like and you prefer uh, to have it in a different way. I will also love to have your feedback in the comments. And if you like this tutorial, remember to leave a like on this video and subscribe to our channel to receive more tutorials like this one. We are also leaving some videos here. I think you will be interested in watching those. And I hope to see you in the next tutorial. Bye bye.